string in my eye. I'll be an example to myself and the tears that I cry. Alright, so I picked this little tie-dye kit up at Walmart. I was in there one day and happened to see it. It's $14.99 at the Walmart down the hill. And then so I did the bleach sub and I like how that turned out. So I wanted to try the tie-dye. So we're gonna see what's in there. Um So I guess this is just some plastic for you to put the shirts on. Todd, I, <clears throat> excuse me, project guide. Um, general instructions. And they show you some, some different ways to do it, which I'm not gonna follow that. I'm gonna just do my own thing because there's no way to mess it up, really. Some gloves came with it. Some rubber bands. And then all these bottles of dye. Like little turquoise. I forgot what's in here. I opened this. Already I wasn't gonna put this in the video, but I decided it might be crucial. So but it was 4, 7, 10, 12. I can't even count. <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 different dyes. So we got this, like a lighter blue. Some green. Some more green. Oh, okay, I see what they did. So it's just two of each color is what it is. I hadn't even looked at the colors, to be honest, when I opened it. I just wanted to read the instructions. Um, no two, I don't have two yellows, though, but like a yellow, orange, or something that's just a little bit, and you're supposed to just fill the bottle up with water to the rim, like a lime green, Red, orange, or some, some purple, several of this color. Um, basically, that's it. Some black. Only gave me one black though. Oh no, it's two blacks. <clears throat> with just some different colors. So it's enough to get started to learn it, the process of it. But it was 18 different bottles. And like I say, you just fill it, take your bottle, fill the water to the rim, get your shirts. So that's that. It's like a gray, which I don't even see how that's gonna stand out if you're using white t-shirts, but hey, um, but what I'm going to do in this video, so I'm going to do one cotton and I'm going to do one polyester shirt and I'm going to see if after tie dyeing with the polyester shirt, I want to see after tie dyeing can I actually do like a dark color sublimation on it and see how that turns out. Um, the cotton would just do some regular old vinyl, but it's going to end up being two videos. One video will be for the cotton, one video will be for the sublimation and we'll see how it turns out but it's a long process you got to dye the shirts let them dry and then like rewash them but what i'll do is uh i'll end up just doing like i do with the bleach uh with the bleach i'll just end up putting a throwing them in a the washer with some cold water and then from there We'll commence to doing the vinyl. We'll commence to doing the sublimation and see how it turns out. I mean, even learning how to do this, getting some good tie-dye in down. See, I mean, you can just sell blanks. There's a lot of people just like blank tie-dye shirts. So that's another product you can add to sell. You know, simple, easy, have a little fun while you're doing it. Get that money together. But, uh... So we're going to get started on these shirts, man. Seek Paris 12 on apparel. Like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Shout out to my squad.
Say How You Feel TV, Mike T's, Your Dig Lifestyle, All Things Styles, man. We got next. 12 going to peril, the dream in my eye. I be an example to myself in the tears that I cry. All right, so we out in the backyard. Um, I got a 100% cotton t-shirt right here, all style. So I got a bucket of water over here. I'm gonna just dunk it in this water. So I guess the dunking in the water is what removes the sizing. That stuff they soak it in to protect the fabric or whatever. Mm. So with this one, I got my rubber bands. I got, I just put filled up the red, black, and yellow. I don't know why I just chose those colors. So I got my rubber bands. It's a cup if I can use to put water in the dye. So I'm gonna do that like that. Do that like that. trying some. I don't know what this pattern gonna look like. It's my first time doing this. So I'm gonna fold that that way. Then I think I'm gonna just rubber band it just like this. I'm gonna make this video two parts because I think it's gonna end up being too long. So in this video, we're just going to color the shirts, let them dry, and we'll reveal them at the end. And then part two, I'm going to press vinyl on this one. Just messed up my pattern, but hey. not doing nothing exact so we're gonna see what that pattern turned out Some black Hit him with some yellow. And then I'm gonna just flip it over. I'm gonna just continue back with the yellow. And again, it's that kit. Oh, I just shot the top off. I just got this kit from Walmart for $15. 
just to see how tie-dye work out, see if I even like it for that matter. <clears throat> I like how the colors look so far. I'm just randomly saturating it. Hope it looks good. So that's the first one. That's the 100% cotton. So I'm going to just set this in the grass and just let it dry. Twelve going apparel, the dream in my eye. I'll be an example to myself in the tears that I cry. So here's the reveal. I set it. It's been drying for a couple days. It was kind of wet, so I just set it in front of the fan and just let it dry. So I, one thing I found is doing this tie-dye, it's better to do a bunch of them at once because all the stuff is drying and then you got to throw it in the washer and all that stuff. It's better to do more than one. So see, failure. First attempt didn't turn out so well. Oh no, it's time, I guess. But looking in here so much it's more white than I would like colors bleeding together but now for the next time I know what not to do and what to do Kind of cool down at the bottom part. And then I, that kit, the colors aren't as vibrant as I thought they would be, which is weird. It's got all style t shirt, too, same t shirt. I think I'm gonna take it back outside. That sleeve, I like how that sleeve turned out pretty dope. Next time I'm gonna get my wife out there with me because she used to do it as a kid, so she knows how, knows what to do, how to do it. But yeah, I think what I'm gonna do is, before I wash it, I'm gonna actually just take some dye and just drop it in to fill in them blank spots. There it is. So this is part one. What I'm gonna do for part two? I'm gonna fill in the blank spots with some more tie dye. Wash it, bring it back, and then we'll just press some vinyl on it and see what happens after that. But if you haven't already, man, like, comment, subscribe. See Paris Tour going apparel. Go. Twelve going apparel. The dream in my eye. I'll be an example to myself in the tears that I cry.